Hey, what's up guys? It's your friend Fast Eddie. I know it's been a while since I did a little update here, but I've been working kind of hard on my little uh, man cave, little budget home theater thing, whatever you want to call it. But uh figured I'd just do a quick video and show you what I've been up to and uh, stuff I'm still working on. But let's just uh, jump right into it. So I added some new posters and uh, a couple little doorways here to close off the sound. But uh, the main big thing here that I've been working on is... Dun, 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 dun. Here's the front uh, stage of it, I guess you could call it. It's an 84 inch screen, and it's actually not a screen, it's projector paint. Like I said, I'm working on a kind of a budget here, so i um, uh, kind of saving up for the screen, but for now, this is going to work perfect actually. Uh, like I said, I did use some uh, projector screen paint there, it's like a nice um, flat gray to it, and as you can see, my walls are like a uh, dark gray. But uh, from where I'm sitting at here, this is the sweet spot, so to say. Uh, like I said, it's uh, 84 inches because I'm only about 10 feet away. So this was um, about as good as I can get uh, with the projector that I'm using. It's kind of um, not the best projector in the world. It's an Epson. I'll show you in a minute. But uh, the screen size, I didn't want to go too big because then it got all pixelated and looked crappy. But this was about the best image and size that I could configure. And I built the frame around it myself as well. Just used uh, some one by fours, painted them a uh, flat black, and it really pops off the wall, so it looks like a nice uh, big screen there sitting on the wall. Got the um, budget-friendly <laughs> Sony center channel there. I do have some uh, Polk stuff coming in, but uh, got the Yamaha receiver in the cable box. PS3 is in there somewhere. Uh, the Polk floor-standing speakers. I'm still using those. Those are the uh, Monitor 55Ts on uh, both sides here. And they actually sound uh, terrific. But uh, yeah, there's the front wall. This is the main thing I've been working on, guys. And then just uh, added some more posters. Classic House on Haunted Hill there. Vincent Price, I love this poster. Got the window unit in there. Got some uh, The Walking Dead bobbleheads up there. Some more of my uh, Lost Dharma Initiative stuff. Little movie theater sign. But uh, this here would be the back nice big ugly couch but it's so comfortable it's hard to get rid of and there you see i got also the polk subwoofer this is the psw 110 um, perfect for what i need it for and i got it sitting there right beside the couch it's kind of like a cheap version of the uh, butt shakers because you can feel it as well as here it's sitting back here so it works out well i'm also using the polk audios on the rears probably not going to show it very well up against that back window there but um I gotta get some blackout too on that window because it's really hard to see the image on a projector, even with the black curtains. But uh, got the Halloween poster back there, and then here's the Epson projector that I'm using. I believe this one is the 3212. It says it's uh, 720p, but it's not a native 720p. Although it does have a HDMI output, which was the main thing I was looking for, but. Um, it's good enough now until, you know, I save up and buy a really nice 1080p projector. But, uh, uh, like I said, from 10 feet away at an 84-inch screen, it gives me a pretty decent picture. We were watching uh, Game of Thrones on it last night, and it looked fantastic. The sound is great. Um, like I said, finally got everything pretty much set up. Um, the screen and the wood and all of that stuff cost me about, I don't know, 30 bucks total so <laughs> nice cheap alternative to spend and you know upwards of a thousand bucks on a decent screen and uh like i said the center channel there and the uh pokes on the sides everything in the whole uh home theater budget guys including you know building the screen the polk speakers the little sony there the receiver um the pokes in the rear the projector everything i'm still less than 1500 bucks and it actually sounds fantastic the picture is good it's not you know excellent it's not a hundred percent of what i want it to be yet but like i said while i'm saving up for a really nice projector this one will uh definitely do for now but anyway like i said just a quick update guys uh, i'm going to show you what i've been up to and uh, i'll give you a little image here of the sweet spot where i sit right here in the middle so i get the nice center channel and the surrounds and a uh, nice big picture where I'm coming from. Alright guys, well thanks for watching and I'll talk to you next time.